Yeah, I'll take the cigarettes. Extra nicotine? Yeah. Hold the tobacco. Thanks. Hey y'all, Scott here. I'm trying new things, broadening my horizons. I'll try cancer, why not? You only live once. You're looking at a new Scott here that hey y'all, so why not celebrate by playing something I've never played before? The holidays are almost here. This season where new games, systems, and experiences are abundant. Everywhere you look, there's something new to play. And not only that, but so many games released throughout the year I missed are crazy cheap. There's really no excuse right now not to play what this year had to offer. Fuck you, I'm playing Wii Chess. As your patented young Nintendo fan that grew up with a GameCube, so does his opinion really matter? I was a big fan of this game, and I was also a big fan of lying. Look at that, three-year-olds can't play chess in America, which means this must have been a European exclusive. So Europe usually gets a raw deal when it comes to games. Some of the greatest games of all time initially never released in Europe. Some of the Wii series of games. Wii Sports, Wii Play, Wii Fit, every Wii owner swapped spit with one of these titles before. However, there are definitely some lesser known and played titles. Wii Music, Wii Play Motion, some people may not even be familiar with Wii Party, but in the grand scheme of it all, this was a juggernaut of a franchise, focusing on simple family fun using the Wii Remote in unique and innovative ways in which anybody could understand. Some people tend to think games like Wii Ski were a part of this series. No. Take a look at the spelling of Wii here. This is as Wii as Dogopoly is Monopoly. It's catching in on the name to get people to think it's a part of the same series. It's not, and I'm tired of acting like it's okay to think it is. But oddly enough, I think more people wrongfully assume this game is a part of the Wii series, when there's a Wii series game they didn't even know existed. Yeah, don't look at me like I don't own Wii Chess. Wii Chess! Let's do a quick check. Yep, this is official. They have the official Wii name. This is a core entry in the Wii series. It's just as Wii series as Wii Sports and Wii Play are. You know, back in the day, I scoured Wikipedia about the Wii series because I wanted to own all the games. There was just something about a series of games I could enjoy with everybody that came over to my house, young and old, that really resonated with me. So when I finished off the collection with Wii Play Motion, I did notice there was a distinct Wii chest shaped crater. The one game I didn't own, and that was because I couldn't own it. Released in 2008 in Europe, I always hoped this game would come over to North America. Why? Because I like chess. Would have been a good reason. I just wanted to experience everything the Wii series had to offer. I wanted to own all the Wii games. It just so happened that was impossible for an 11 year old North American who didn't know Europe existed yet. But then 12 years later, I reached a new low. A European Wii U, which can play European Wii games, not unlike my Japanese Wii U, which can play Japanese Wii games, and then my second North American Wii U, which can play North American games, just like my primary Wii U. I label my rooms based on what Wii U's in them. With a European Wii U, I had no excuse not to own Wii Chess. No excuse at all, I couldn't come up with any. Released on January 18th, 2008 in Europe, Wii Chess is a chess game where you can challenge a world-class computer or compete against players online. What kind of box art is this? What is that, a napkin? Now this game did get a release in Japan on September 30th, 2008 under the name Sushin Taikyoku World Chess and was only available via WiiWare, so it was downloadable only and wasn't a part of the Wii series over there. It's weird they didn't bring the game over to North America as a WiiWare game at the very least. I mean, it's chess. I mean, sure, the Europeans have that one on us. We can't fight back. They like chess more. What makes the fact this game never made it over here even more confusing is the fact that not only did Nintendo publish the game, they developed it too. Nintendo SPD. They didn't outsource this. This was a project Nintendo tackled themselves from within. They got Art Tune to make Fling Smash, but they had to make Wii Chess themselves. If this was a case of Nintendo seeing a chess game in development for the Wii and deciding, sure, we'll publish that and rename it Wii Chess, that would make sense. Nope, this was calculated. Board Game Classic comes to Wii. I think it's Kane. There was Ultimate Board Game Collection on Wii, which released before Wii Chess, and chess was included, so is this really a moment worth having a tagline over? Fun for all levels, play against opponents near and far, improve your technique? Cut the bullshit, just get to the f***ing chess! Oh, but wait, a true challenge for experts. Wii Chess uses Loop Express, a conversion of the Loop Chess engine which ranked third in the 2007 World Computer Chess Championship in Amsterdam. Well, they told me. Interesting thing to mention here, considering most people who consider buying Wii Chess look like this. I'm tired of being known as the guy who owns Wii Chess. I want to be the guy who's played Wii Chess. It's time to see what America can. This is Wii Chess. It sure is. Jesus Christ. So this is a game of chess. 
How am I disappointed? Well, first off, I mean, would it have killed them to put checkers in here as a side mode? You have the board already there. Don't tell me it would have been too much to design checker pieces. Chess is a game everybody knows about, yet few actually know how to effectively play. I think the idea of making a Wii series game about it with pointer and motion controls with Miis to help more people understand how to play and enjoy chess is a great idea. It's a game that stood the test of time that could have benefited from a Wii era Nintendo makeover. Guess what Wii Chess is? What is this? What's that? What do they have against capitalization? Where are the Mii's? Is there a tutorial mode? Are there any modes? One player, two player, online play. There's more bullet points on the back of the box than things to do. Why are the credits called Chess Staff? Three directors? I thought Wii Music was the most worthless Wii game. Doesn't mean I don't anymore, but still. Uh, what's this game's deal? At first, I'm like, yeah, the concept kind of makes sense, but the more you dive into it, the less it makes sense. It's like a cult. Wii Chess is the freak of Nintendo published Wii games, especially considering it's a part of the Wii series. I feel like you can't just make anything a Wii series game. It has to have certain elements. Wii Music and Wii Fit Plus are completely different games, but they feel like they're cut from the same cloth. Wii Chess defies that all. It does whatever it wants. It's Wii Chess, bitch. Everything in this game is 2D, from the menu interface to the chess pieces and boards themselves. There are Nintendo DS games with more 3D elements than this. No Miis are used, which is even more shocking. Like, why do I set up my save file by typing in my name when you could have just had me select a me to represent my save file like pretty much any other Wii game. And here we are at the main menu. Of course, they didn't capitalize menu. They were too busy not capitalizing data. No, players here isn't capitalized, but buttons and game settings are. All right, well, let's play versus CPU. I think there needs to be a period after versus since it's an abbreviation. And they're just forcing me to peer review, aren't they? <laughs> we get to pick our level. Remember the box fun for all levels? Sure, that'll make anybody run to the register, but it also holds truth. There are multiple difficulty levels here. You can trust Wii Chess. I mean, how many chess games have lied to you? Only like four. It was the headlighting feature. I'm glad they kept their word. Get to choose the color of my pieces. Oh man, they don't have green. And we're off! As somebody who doesn't know how to play chess, I know exactly what my first move in Wii Chess is gonna be. You use the D-pad to move your pieces in Wii Chess. Oh man, I can't wait till Wii Chess comes out in the States and I can use the Wii Remote's pointer. I got into fishing instead. How are you gonna have a chess game on the Wii made by Nintendo that uses the D-pad to move chess pieces? Was that really the most intuitive way to do this on the Wii? Especially with a game in the Wii series, a series all about showcasing what the Wii Remote can do! Well, maybe the series isn't about what the Wii Remote can do. Maybe they're just games anybody can pick up and play. What the f am I doing here? There are no lessons on how to play chess. The only way you'll get enjoyment out of this game is if you already know how to play chess. But if you already know how to play chess, then you probably already have a chess board. Oh, but this way you can play against the computer. Speaking of computers, wasn't chess preloaded on Windows Vista at the time? It's not like we as human beings were deprived of e-chess. What's the point of making a chess video game if you're not gonna jazz it up? Throw your Miis in there, have them playing chess in a 3D modeled park on a fall day or something, or in a gymnasium or a casino, I don't know. There's loads of options here. Why is this its own game when you could have had a bunch of board games included. Checkers, Chinese checkers, whatever, but no! You just have a 2D board with 2D pieces. That doesn't even make sense perspective-wise. What, am I looking directly down at the chessboard here? This whole game, I mean, it works. I still think it's weirdly inconsistent with capitalization and it uses the Wii font for some things, which is odd to see this font used outside of just the standard Wii logo. It almost looks like a fan game, which at that point, yeah, it looks like a decently made Flash game you play online. But I mean, the interface is clean, the music is pleasant, it's chess, but why was this a game on its own? You could have bundled this in with Wii Play and incorporated the pointer and it would have worked great there. And again, why doesn't this game use the pointer? The D-pad works fine, but why? You can also use the class controller because I need a real controller for this. But chess on its own? I mean, Clubhouse games on the Nintendo DS released a year and a half prior. That included chess and 41 other games. These were the same price. Which I mean, yeah, Wii Chess wasn't as expensive as other Wii games. It wasn't as cheap either. Roughly $30 in Europe doubloons for something that we as human beings have as one of our three rights. The big draw of Wii Chess is the online connectivity, being able to play chess with others across the world. Well, that's another blow to Wii Chess. I mean, what else is there to this game? You can change the theme of chess pieces and boards. That's kind of fun. There's a good chunk of them to roll through. You can rewatch old games you played to hone in your skills, uh, go through the history of games. I waited 12 years to be this disappointed. I just don't understand how this game exists, especially considering they put the Wii branding on it. No Miis, no Wii Remote functionality, no tutorials. There's a hint option, but that just plays a piece for you. It's like, thanks, but that's no fun. I understand some people may prefer the D-pad use compared to pointer controls, and it's not like using the D-pad doesn't work. It's just, this is a Nintendo-developed Wii game. Why is it like this? And at the very least, why didn't this come out in North America as a WiiWare game? Physically? Oh god, no, burn it. But digitally for like 10 bucks, I think it would have been all right, especially considering the online play. But as it stands, 
I don't get it. I assume nobody else did. I mean, I don't even think Europeans know this game exists. Or it's part of their citizenship test. I don't know, they might be proud of it. I can barely find any advertisements for this game out there. I wouldn't blame anybody for not knowing it exists. Eh, here's your warning. Hey, f***er, you like chess? Yeah! And I hate pointing! Introducing Wii Chess, finally. Chess you can't feel. Wanna play chess and nothing else? Yeah, what does it look like? I like pointing? Introducing Wii Chess, the only chess game on Wii called Wii Chess. Featuring a pre-existing engine and acting like it's a major feature when in reality using a pre-existing engine is a lot easier than making a brand new one from scratch and acting like it's a big feature on the back of the box. Pointing. Introducing Wii Chess. It's perfect if you want to try new things. 